We're trying Boulevard Cafecito. Let's ride. Bag secured. Starting off with a palate cleanser. Stay hydrated. Cold brew. It's very, very bitter. It's very, very smooth. Not super strong, a little on the lighter side. There are sweeter notes, maybe a little chocolate, maybe a little, maybe a little cherry like the other one. This is a fantastic cold brew, which maybe could only be improved with an added amount of strength. So I'm gonna give this an 8.7. Cold brew round two. It is not as strong. It's definitely got that little bit of bitterness to it. It doesn't have like a lot of the sitting into it, it's very smooth. This is probably one of my favorite cold brews that we've tried so far because I feel like it's not too acidic. It's super smooth and it does have that sweetness, a little bit of, little bit of chocolate into it. I'm gonna give this a nine even. All right, we're trying the Cuban Cafe con Leche from Boulevard Cafecito. It's very creamy, it's super rich. Definitely a heavier milk. You still get the espresso taste and then the kind of the burnt sugar taste from the Cafe Con Leche. I've had a better Cafe Con Leche, but in LA, this is probably the best I've had. I definitely will come back for it, so I'm going to give it an 8.6. Definitely see what Zach's saying. I'm definitely impressed with the, the frothiness once again. It's a quality froth. Um, very milky, very creamy, very sweet. The notes of like sweetness that are custardy and like kind of like um, like a nice dessert um, are nice and refreshing. I do wish it had a little bit more of a coffee flavor, so that kind of lowers it. I'm gonna give this an eight flat. Boulevard Cafecito, famous OG burrito. The first thing that jumps out is the amazing presence of hash browns in this. I'm humbled by their presence. The flavor of the bacon cuts like a knife in such a positive way. It's warm, freshly prepared. This absolutely earns a Mamma Mia. Um, the bacon, the hash browns, the egg. It's a fantastic breakfast burrito and I'm gonna give this a 9.3. Oh my God. Breakfast burrito take two with a house made hot sauce. The house-made hot sauce has to be one of my favorite hot sauces I've ever had. It's just perfectly spicy. The hash browns in the burrito are absolutely key. One of my favorite foods is hash browns too, so they're just tugging at my heartstrings here with the beautiful hot sauce. And this may be my favorite breakfast burrito in Los Angeles so far. This one has a leg up on the unincorporated coffee burrito for me, just because it's got the soft tortilla, which I prefer to a crispy tortilla. It just removes the flakiness, adds a little bit of that texture. So that gives it a one up for me. I'm gonna give this burrito a 9.6. You know who might be the chip that gets me Bijan? Steph Diggs. The first bite of the Big Papa cinnamon roll. The icing is the king here. The icing is creamy, soft, sweet, cinnamony. This is, this is gonna be affected by the lack of heated up, which I feel bad for. In terms of the taste, it's not a super sweet. I wanna give this a, 7.8. I don't know about y'all, but I'm a huge like take a bite of a pastry and then take a sip of coffee with it in my mouth. Is that weird? The cinnamon roll itself is fantastic. It should be heated up. The icing is probably definitely the highlight. It's very pure, true cinnamon. It's not like cinnamon sugar. So there is a little bit of that cinnamon, almost bitterness, right? Like. It pairs really nicely with the cold brew. So if you go to Cafecito, start with the burrito, grab this for dessert, and pair it with a cold brew, you're set. I'm gonna give the cinnamon roll 7.8 as well. Yeah, that's correct. Hi, I'm Louisa. I uh, tag along with the boys today. First of all, hanging out with them is a 10 out of 10 experience. Uh, but as far as Cafecito goes, it was really good. I got to taste everything. I'd say overall, my score, probably an 8.5. I'd say it was a good, it was a really good trip. Everything was delicious. I had a great time. So thanks for letting me tag along, guys. Boulevard Cafecito came in hot with an average score of 8.6. Let us know where you want us to review next.